Hello and welcome back to my channel guys, I'm your host Nobody, and today we're going back to TCG Card Shop Simulator. Alright, so we're on day 6, let's go ahead and start the store, as we don't have a whole lot of money to work with. I did unlock these rare cards, I believe that's what they were. And yeah, the rare cards, for whatever reason, during editing of the last episode, I kinda cut that part out that I unlocked those, but hey, you know, they're there now, so you guys know. Alright, hello, 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 welcome back, you want $11 change, there you go. So, I really don't know what's on the agenda for today i do know i want to unlock a lot more product that's for sure and this guy of course wants to buy some of the new packs thank you thank you three dollars change seems to be a trend this morning all right so we got about four hundred dollars to work with let's go ahead and see what we're gonna do so we still need to get some levels before we can unlock any of these other things but i want to look at maybe accessories uh we can possibly do these dice but we are gonna need another storage medium so let's see the small metal rack let's go ahead and just buy one of those and that's what we're gonna kind of hold the dice onto all right so where are we gonna put this uh maybe as an end cap for our cards kind of out of the way i do want to leave that wall primarily for shelves there we go it kind of clicks into place now let's go see about these licensing at 50 dollars a pop i kind of want to do the blue because it's kind of the theme of the channel here and they're very expensive we got to sell something i guess we're just gonna do the one but hopefully after a couple more sales we should be able to afford it and possibly with this one he bought a box exact change thank you sir now i'm thinking that might be it so let's go ahead and check this out we want to go to accessories scroll down and yes we can just barely afford the one and here we go new product uh we're gonna put it on the top shelf why not uh can only hold eight. Oh, there's still more in the box hold on two shelves worth yeah, two shells worth, so there we go. So let's see, market price plus 10% round. We're gonna be making close to $7 profit for each one of those sold. So I think that was a pretty good investment considering how cheap they were, another $19 change. Hey, another bot sold. Uh, Actually, how are we doing? We only got about two boxes left. Give me your change, a dollar change. I can work with that. Oh shit, hold on, dude. We got a smelly. How do I, how do, I do this again? Nice. Hopefully uh, he didn't mess up our rating. Let's actually go ahead and check that. Yeah, he didn't affect it, so we caught it just in time. And I think we are completely out of cards. Let me actually go over here and look. Yeah, we're completely out of cards. So we're definitely gonna have to open some packs here. And you, sir, are the first one to buy our first dice and uh, $3 change again. So let's go ahead and open some of these rare packs. I know we don't have a lot of them, but uh, hey, we need to kind of restock in other ways. All right, the price on that one wasn't that good, but we did get a lot of new cards, less than $2 value for that whole pack. And more of the same for the second one. Yeah, we just barely broke $4. Oh, that one kind of looks cool, the Wispo. Hey, that one looks really cool too, the Angie's, uh, about $3. All right, let's roll through this. We got about, we should be able to sell that card for about five bucks, so that's pretty decent. I think this is the last pack, let's go. All right, well, that should be it. I see another stinky, let's go ahead and do this again. Hey man, uh, we're gonna, oh wait, 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 come on, not at the card table. All right, that, that's ridiculous. All right, let's go ahead and check out some more guys. Uh, let's go ahead and see if we can order some more boxes here real quick. All right, and that should leave us uh, one more left over. Actually, we're just gonna open that one here in a minute. Do we have anybody? Yeah, I know, we, we don't have any cards. All right, so let's go ahead and open this. No, don't pick it up. Hopefully big money. Oh, starting off with an EX, $10 sits in, Sunflort, cool. All right, not bad, not bad start. And that one was a complete bust. Yeah, well, I not even a dollar. All right, hello, hello. Hey, we got another achievement. Open 100 card packs, nice. All right, change. Uh, is that change? Thank you, sir. All right, so let's go ahead and see what we got going on here. Let's, uh, how do we sort again? F to sort. We want to sort by price. All right, hands full. All right. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. We're trying to get those to you as quickly as possible. It's starting to get dark. I need to turn on the lights here after this. Uh, $19 change. I can make that happen. All right. Lights. Uh, you already went ahead and bought one of those. $10. It's that. There we go. All right. So let's see. If we... Let's just kind of consolidate all these to one shelf. Because I do want to uh, move these rares over if possible. All right. There we go. Let's go ahead and pick those up right there. And we'll put the rares right here. So we got $190. Uh, we want to buy two packs of the rares. Yeah. Pick these up. We'll load this up. We'll have a few left over. So we'll open whatever's left. <laughs> Oh, sneaky, stinky, stinky, stinky. Hold on, hold on. No, not in my store, dude. All right, I think we caught him in time. Uh, let's just go ahead and make sure. 
Yeah, we did, so no bad reviews. All right, so let's go ahead and load up uh, this second one here. I think we're gonna do the same with the basic patch. We're just gonna do top and bottom here. All right, sir, what do you want? Uh, a lot of dice. I need to actually look over there. How many do we have left? It looks like we got plenty. That was 53 bucks. Another stinky, dear Lord, dude. All right, take care of your ass. So not many people are coming in. Let's just go ahead and open some more packs. I meant to stop at it, but that mummy looking one is pretty neat. Hey, we got an E. Yeah, it's thirteen dollars and forty-two cents. Budwin, uh, that's actually pretty cool. Nice. Hey, and another E. Ads, man, twenty-two dollars sixty cents. We got a cross list. That's awesome. And uh, the E. Ads kind of fits. I don't know if all the E. Ads cards have that purple border, but it works with the blue there. And a gold edition. This was a really, really good pack. Three dollars and seventy-eight cents on that card. Total value forty dollars in that pack. Nice. All right. So tables are full. I believe this box is empty. Let's go ahead and throw that away. We got a hundred dollars. We need to do some restocking. Well, definitely over here at the cards. Uh, three dollar change. Ah, uh, man, what is with you guys? today all right card tables are empty it's nine o'clock the day is done let's go ahead and press enter all right so items earning 325 17 dollars card earnings and 200 dollars on the tables only a total of 534 profit um not too good we're in the negative still so next day all right, well, before we start the day, just because, you know, time doesn't move here, let's go ahead and get one of these packs. Let's see, I wanna just preemptively go ahead and get some hairspray, just in case, uh, 113 bucks. All right, let's buy it. All right, and again, same as yesterday, whatever's left over, we get to open, which looks like it's only gonna be one card, but hey. Uh, let's just go ahead and grab this. No, there's absolutely nothing in there. What the hell? My math isn't the best. Uh, I think prices actually fluctuate, so let's go ahead and check. That still looks pretty good uh that also looks pretty good what about this um that's still close enough i think we're actually pretty golden here i'm just gonna i'm gonna reset this just just in case yeah we lost some profit but because we uh reset that hopefully we're gonna move more product in the end uh how's our dice looking our dice looks like it possibly could have one more box added well we're not gonna do that because that's 166 bucks we're open come on come on all right how many people on the street man we got a we got a couple cats, a couple cats, no stinkies in sight, thank goodness. Good price, thank you, thank you. I took extreme measures this morning to make sure the prices were fair and just. Nice, uh, this should be a fairly decent order, and he got a card on top of that. Let's see, $29, uh, could have been better on the uh, money you gave me, but let's see, $71 sell, nice. And she also bought some of the, uh, the dice there. All right, $17 for a pack of dice, that seems expensive to me, but what do I know? It's too smelly. Come on! I really just want to kick these guys out, not even let them in, but hey. Just because that guy said something, yeah, yeah, right as the guy was leaving too, that's a shame. Uh, what are our options to actually take care of that? Ooh, 500 bucks for the auto sent M100. Uh, we're gonna have to do that, and it says 100 customers played in shop, so we got another achievement there. Looks like we have one dice left, let's just go ahead and buy another one of those. We can actually open- oh, I didn't realize how many you actually bought. This is gonna be a big order. $85. I do want to get this M100 because it is kind of scaring off customers and lowering our overall rating. However, uh, I'm also wanting to expand the store and shop expansion number one is going to be about 300 bucks. I don't think that will be too meaningful right away. Uh, I think getting more product in here, honestly, you know, over everything would probably be the best course of action. We just hit level eight, so we can buy this. I don't think it's really worth it though. But however, we do have this. We do have a couple plushies that we can unlock. I want to get this, but I kind of want to just skip it and go straight for the, uh, this one, whatever this one is, the Nominite plush, uh, $700, and we get 16 of them versus the 12, so this might actually be a better investment in our money. Uh, we need to open some more cards as well, because I don't really have the best cards to sell. Every one of these is pretty much just going to be a singular dollar, but hey, what can you do? So our goal right now, I guess, is to save up about $700, if at all possible, so that we can get that plush, which I think we can do that fairly soon. Good price. Well, then buy one. Well, I'm gonna take one of these. What about the dice, man? You complimented the price. Good price. So you got some, uh, you got some air freshener. That's cool. What about the dice, man? Man, you just cleaning me out. Hey, he took some dice. Nice. 
Oh, wow. I didn't realize how many bounces you took. How are we doing over there? We only got three left. All right. Playing with credit card. 98 bucks. I do believe that is our largest purchase to date. So I'm pretty excited about that. All right. No stankies today. Thank goodness. Uh, even on the street, I don't really see anybody kind of coming up on me. All right. Let's go ahead and restock one of these boxes. They're only 50 bucks. Uh, it's not as bad as, like, say, the dice. That's $166 to restock those. All right. Let's check again. Any more smellies? No smellies. Hey, sir. You you don't have to just watch. Just buy yourself some cards and you too can play this amazing game of- What's the actual name of this? Terramon? Terramon. You too can play some Terramon. Checking again, making sure, making sure. I'm gonna get the uh, the jump on one of these guys. Alright, so we're about $350 if we check one more time. I'm still kind of up in the air whether I want to go for the $500 or the $700 plush. Uh, maybe just whichever one I can afford. Probably the- Honestly, I'm, I'm thinking about it. The $500 one probably would be better. The restock cost on these is probably going to be very high. Oh, hello. You made your decision quick. I wasn't expecting that. Three dollars yet again. Man, today's going by slow. Let's go ahead and open some packs. Uh, let's see. The Wispo, man. For whatever reason, that one really appeals to me. It looks really cool. The Two Frost is also cool. I see your purchase, sir. Uh, just one moment, please. Hey, first edition Lumi, about $8. We can probably sell that for about $9. So it's going to be a good card. We don't have a duplicate of it. It does say it's new, so we'll have to wait for another one. Hey, the Wispo Silver Edition, about three bucks. Nice. Gold Edition Pitsy for $6.36. Also nice. Hey, and we got a holographic crab blocks. $4, though. Pretty nice. All right, decent, decent packs. Uh, let's go ahead and turn on the lights for you guys. Thank you, sir, for your wait. We are just shy of our goal of 500 bucks. Let's go ahead and restock some of these cards here if we can. All right. Hello, 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 hello. Thanks for the wait. You bought two of my cards. One dollar change. Appreciated. That's $59. We just now... Oh, my God. All right. So I'm not even going to think about it. Screw thinking about reason. Let's go ahead and do that. Uh, $162. That is as expensive as restocking the dice. So not as bad as I thought. So let's go ahead and check out here. We it's like zombies in the night, dude. I'm going to get you before you even come into the store, dude. But I'm thinking we're doing pretty good. Uh, our stock should hold us for a little while. Let's just go ahead and see if we can consolidate this a little bit. So once we hit nine o'clock, um, we'll open what's left on that shelf and hopefully get some nice cars. Oh my God. Not today, dude. Not today. Get out of here. Hopefully when these two get done, we'll have enough to restock on some plush or, you know, get the initial stock. Yeah, we'll have a spot right there when we clear out those cards. How you guys doing? You having fun? It's nine o'clock. I know it's time-based. Uh, however long they're sitting at this table is how much they pay me, but uh, it's nine o'clock and the clock ain't moving. So can I just kick them out? Yeah, I can. All right, get out of here. So we're just shy of our goal. Let's go ahead and end the day and see what our uh, results are. All right, so $556 on our items. That's pretty good. I think that's among our best that we've done so far. 235 on the table. So we're just shy of our all-time best. I believe we got up to 900, but still somehow our overall profit is negative $36. Uh, upgrade cost, we did buy it. Yeah, we bought the plushie. So that's, that's gonna be where all of our money went. And then of course, resupply next day. I ain't even gonna wait. Come on in, come on in. Let's uh, see. No stinkies first thing in the morning. I appreciate that. Oh, shit. I forgot to uh, look at the price. What did you say? Good price? All right, cool. Uh, what about the price here? Bam, bam, bam. That's still 20. Okay, so no change there. Let's go ahead and put that over there. Somebody bought two boxes. It was you. Bam, 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 bam. And uh, $7 change. Not too bad. All right. Well, we officially have enough money for the uh, plush. I'm not even gonna hesitate. Let's go ahead and do this and purchase all right these things better be worth it they cost a lot to unlock and they cost a lot to stock up so hopefully hopefully the profit margin is great it looks like we're at least gonna get two shelves worth that was horrible and let's set the price on these guys uh 1345 uh a piece uh, guys already gotten one nice our box is still our number one producer what the hell What's 45 cents? All right, let's just go ahead and pay this and uh, let's see what's going on here. So where did that odd price come from? Was it a card? I think it might've been a card. All right, well, I didn't use these cards up yesterday. Let's just go ahead and open this one, kind of make up for it. All right, not too good start. 31, 32, 17, 37. Yeah, that was not a good pack. I should've just left that one on the shelf. All right, sir, 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 sir. Thank you, thank you. All right, 15 bucks. 
Wrong amount. Oh, 185. Dear Lord. That was a misclick. All right, any stinkies out here? No, we're still good. Early in the morning, they haven't even woke up. They'll they'll be awake by noon. All right, stock is kind of getting a little low on some of these items, or at least apparently they are. I'm going to hold off as long as possible. I do want to try to work towards maybe getting... Um, another license let's go ahead and check something here real quick so the basic card pack for eight is two hundred dollars would that make the overall cost cheaper to buy in greater quantity maybe that might be something we look into we'll experiment with this before we dive into you know these more expensive packs because dear god like some of these are really expensive to unlock seventeen dollars what is the profit margin on these dice because it seems pretty high it's 64 not that great what is so 13.45 on the the plush which technically makes that our best yeah this has gone down to uh 750 so uh the plush by far is definitely our best but these keep selling out it is past 12 o'clock we do need to start watching out for the stinkies i feel all right let's go ahead and check for them are they out yet no they're not uh we got about 200 dollars i'm just gonna go ahead and bite the bullet let's do that so what does that do for us i'm actually just gonna bust out a calculator so let's see 95.52 divided by two equals 4767 so it's the exact same so it was it was a waste of 200 dollars is what that was all right well now we know we ain't gonna do that in the future all right gotta check it in yeah all right cool Ooh, we're down to two boxes uh well since we got it let's just go ahead and i don't know hell let's just order two why not all right so 200 dollars big bots got the big eight i'm actually gonna just go ahead and put these on the bottom i want to actually fill those up just because these are our biggest money maker i do want to make sure that we have a nice nice supply of them there we go about five sessions worth all right three boxes i think it's working guys 60 bucks uh, let's go ahead and look. Are we safe? Yeah, we're still safe. All right. I think, dude, I think, we, I think we're on to something. Having these cards. Oh my God. All right. So we're ending the day with uh, $220. Uh, not a lot of money, but we should earn that bad fairly quickly. All right. And, um, we are completely stocked up. It kind of makes me want to buy another shelf. How much are those? We can get a small shelf for 150 bucks and we might end up doing that. Yeah, let's go ahead. Let's just go ahead and do that. All right, there we go. Now we're left with $70 and put that, I don't know, pretty close over here. And that gives us more room to put more of these packs. All right, well, I'm feeling pretty good about that. Let's go ahead and end the day. All right, so we finally burped $1,000. You can see the item earning is $742 or by far our highest yet. Our game earnings is kind of stagnant right now. I don't know why it's getting so low. And the cards is only 13 bucks. Uh, we just haven't been getting a lot of duplicates. A lot of new cards, a lot of good cards, but no duplicates. All right, next day. Uh, not even gonna wait. Hold your horses. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Get out of here. Oh my god. A hundred and twenty dollars. That is now officially our highest amount yet. Oh my god, dude. How much is this gonna be? And you bought a card? Two cards? A hundred and thirty-five dollars. The new chain of money. And then there's this guy that just buys a three-dollar card. Uh, hold on, hold on. Are we safe? Yeah, we're safe. All right. Well, we got a bit of change. Let's go ahead and do our first its shop expansion here. And there we go. Kind of opened up here in the little side cubby here. It's gonna kind of make it hard to see. Uh, to keep tabs of what's actually here, but uh, it gets it out of the way a little bit. And we'll put that one right beside it. And we'll also put that right there. So that kind of opens up the floor. Oh my god. Now I kind of want to get another shop expansion just to uh, kind of hold on to our boxes. I really don't like them in the store. They get kicked around a lot. Let's go ahead and put that right there. But I guess, you know, what we really could do is we can uh, put them up here. Maybe right here. All right. There we go. In the last three minutes, dude. Uh, clean 100 smelly customers. I had no idea I did that many already. I have been all out war with those guys since uh, the beginning of the game. And uh, you guys get the hell out. We are closed. So as promised, we got some cards to open here. All right, this is the first time I'm going to pull out a full box. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. All right, what do you got? Well, all right, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna argue with that. All right, now get out. All right, here we go. 32 card patch. Let's do this. All right, not off to the greatest start. The first pack, I don't even think it broke $3 in value. Uh, second one, just barely under five. Hey, there we go. A rat's new card. Holographic, $3.88. Uh, not the greatest value, but it does look good.
I'm genuinely at a loss for words. I really don't know what to say right now. Uh, what are these called? The ghost? The ghost cards? I don't even know how to say it. The dragonets? I don't even know if we've seen that card yet. $352? Wow. Just wow. How much SP does that give us? Only 20. That's, that's kind of insulting for the value of that card, but hey. Well, uh, it was really hard to follow up after that, uh, that ghost card, but we did get a lot of duplicates. Um, we should be able to fill some of this up. Let's go ahead and do that real quick. Ghost cards is stored in a different album. You can open sort menu and select ghost to see it. All right, sort menu. Let's go ahead and look at that ghost one more time, guys. That looks, that looks incredible. I don't even think we have the regular version of this card. That might come in later packs. That's just cool. That's just cool. We got to get a display case to kind of see those, I believe. You know, kind of put them on display. All right, but we got a new high value card, $78.80. I thought we had one in the 80s, but I guess not. So even after all that spinning we did, we still made $6.75. Honestly, not sustainable. Item earnings, 778 The game earnings did go up uh, close to $300. Uh, we did buy that table, I think, half way through the day so uh but a new highest revenue eleven $1 hundred dollars and 42 cents all right next day all right well we finished day 10 with a pretty good profit margin i only had to restock some of these boxes i got some hairspray and i was completely sold out of dice i wanted to kind of keep it to a minimum as much as possible because i did want to purchase this today all right so where are we actually going to put this display case i want it to be somewhere nice i'm thinking maybe right here by the door is going to be a pretty good spot for it all right so let's go ahead and pull out our card thing how do we sort this thing again yeah ghost we want to take that completely and put it in our display case and boy does that look sweet well if you guys enjoyed today's episode and that ghost card please consider leaving a like and subscribe as i am a small channel and it does help me out tremendously and with that guys i will see you all in the next one